Hello and welcome to White Horse Music TV. My name is Richard Bodino and I'm co-owner of this wonderful shop with my lovely wife Michelle Bodino who is not currently here unfortunately. Today I am demonstrating a couple of different brands of cellos. Now um, the two brands are called Regetti and Scott Chow. Um, originally, a long time ago, I used to just get Rigetti cellos, and the Rigettis were amazing cellos, beautifully made, superior to anything else in their price range, as far as, you know, the quality of workmanship and that sort of thing went. And they were made under the instruction of Peter Guan and Scott Chow, according to the literature that I had. So, um, working together. And then, all of a sudden, a few years ago, I now could get Scott Chow cellos and Rigetti cellos. And I asked the suppliers, how come, wasn't it Scott Chow and Peter Guan working together to make these Rigetti cellos? And they said, yes, but they had some sort of argument or disagreement or something like that. And Scott Chow went off on his own and started making cellos and um, the and Peter Guan still is, um, we're having them made under the Rigetti label as a, a separate thing. And I picture, just for my own amusement, I picture Scott Chow and Peter Guan throwing cellos at each other and smashing stuff and getting really angry and then Scott Chow storming off and, and saying, I'm going to make better cellos than you. Probably none of that happened, and probably they didn't even have an argument, who knows. But um, it's interesting, and so I have, you know, I thought to myself, okay, I'm going to narrow it down, I'm going to decide which one's better, and I'm going to stock whichever one that is. And I've been trying to do that for the last sort of three years, and they're both too awesome not to have in the shop, and they are different enough that I, I just have to have both of them. This one, my friends, is a Regetti cello. They did, I oh, like the one little change I've noticed since Scott Chow was no longer there is they, they look a little bit darker than they used to. I mean, the these models, they have a little bit yeah, darker varnish. I'm not sure if that, that was what the argument was over. I want them to look a bit darker. Um, I'm not sure about that. But you know, I've set this one up with all of our beautiful parts and everything. And it sounds magnificent and deep. But this one, this particular one is called the Rigetti RC6 cello. Rigetti RC6. Did I get that right? Whoa, I even got that right. Rigetti RC6. Um, and this one is, I think, um, 2695 cello by itself, including all of our wonderful setup, which, um, you know, is, um, would be worth squillions of dollars by itself should be worth squillions of dollars. All right, so I'll play this one first, and then I will play the Scott Chow, which is in a similar price range, and then you can decide which one is better, and you can write it in the comments. for its price range and from a maker's point of view it's just it's so beautifully made that's the other thing now this is mr. Scott Chow the competitor in the left corner uh, <laughs> it's a more sort of like honey color sort of cello this one's called the SCC 35 CE <laughs> a very elaborate name uh, SCC 35 CE, the CE refers to Chinese woods. I think both the Rigetti and the Scott Chow both use Chinese woods. There's a model above this in the Scott Chow which uses European wood. Yeah, there you go. And both of these we've set up with lass and strings and the better bridge and made a new sound post and spent about five hours on them, turning them into something that sounds amazing and is easier to play because we're the best shop in the world 
Um, now, I will play this one, and then what I'll do is I'll play them straight after each other without talking so that you don't have to listen to my voice. deep it's it's very ringing and um, even across the strings um, I would say the difference to me is maybe the rigetti is very very slightly deeper in the bottom but maybe isn't quite as even as the Scott Chow and the Scott Chow is a bit lighter on its feet sort of thing it's like a little bit easier to move your bow um, between the notes, like it, it responds slightly differently, so slightly more easily, but maybe you can get slightly more out of the rigetti. So it's, oh, I would really, like if I was to have to choose, I would really struggle between these two because they've both got their own sort of little advantages. So I'll play a little something on this and then I'll play a little something on that without you having to listen to my voice. <laughs> that I did a little bit of a fumbly thing and that possibly is to do with uh, you know slightly slower response I mean it's not slow responding it's just the scotch hours are really fast responding in that way um, oh, I would really really struggle to choose between these two cellos tell me what you think in the comments tell me which one is better and then I will buy it hang on I already did thanks for watching